Hey y'all, it's me, your gal Sal, and we're back with Subnautica. Uh, I don't remember what we did the last time. I think it was something with baby crap balls, but who knows? Also, let's just jump right into it, shall we? Well, we put the drill arm on so we can go get all the large deposits of minerals and rocks and ores and things like that. But I was thinking, there was a base that I believe we were supposed to find, and it was the one that I've heard several people talk about, and I believe somebody commented on one of my videos about it, about the proposed Degasi habitat. That's the one that's supposed to be like very far below. So I think today what we're gonna do is try to locate that habitat, see if there's any blueprints or data that we may be missing, and then go from there. Let's hop in to, you know what? Let's not take baby crap balls because baby crap balls doesn't have that defense mechanism. Let's take Petunia and we'll dock her into holy crap balls and we're going to head that way. So our plan for this episode is to find that other Degasi habitat. I know it's there. I know people have commented on my other videos about it and I want to find it. But first I need to go back to their habitat within the Jelly Shroom Cave just to make sure I didn't forget anything because I'm pretty sure somebody said that I had to have a data download and I don't remember having one. So I have the beacon set for the Degasi habitat. We're going to take Petunia there and we're going to scout the whole thing and try to find anything that we may have left behind. So let's get going. Is Petunia inside of Holy Crap Balls? Yeah. No. No. No, she's not. Welcome aboard, Captain. All right. Oh, I need food and water. Do I have any? That would be a no. I don't have food or water. All right. So apparently, I need to eat and get water. So let's just get all the bladder fish and all the peepers. So let's get all this stuff cooked up and then we can get on our way. All right, Petunia, where you be, girl? Somewhere, oh, there she is, okay. And then we'll head on to where we gotta go. Where are that beacon's over here. Here we go. I'm not really worried about the crab snakes or any of the other really big creatures. But I am worried about running into all these damn fish. Can you just not, please? That would be wonderful. Yes. There we go. And now we have all the depth meters on Petunia, so we don't have to worry about crushing or anything like that. So let's make sure that we've gotten everything that we can get. Um, let's turn on defense mechanism here. There we go, we've shocked a few things. There was supposed to be I just want to make sure I got everything. I'm pretty sure there was supposed to be a data download, but I'm not sure if I got it. I mean, obviously I didn't. Because nothing else was triggered. No other data downloads in there. Yeah, there aren't any more unless I'm... Oh my God, there is something in there. Just try not to touch this thing. Oh, I touched it. Oh my god, there was something up here! I was right! Okay, good. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Yes! 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 Integrating new PDA data. We can finally find it! Let's get in the sea mob. What's going on? Oh, y'all. Let's see. Let's see where we going. Ooh, Paul Torgel's log, too. We're going to give this a listen. You know what Maida told me today? She wants to build a habitat 500 meters below sea level 
more than a kilometer northeast of here. And she needs Bart and I to do it. She's got it into her head that she can save us if she just acts recklessly enough. But I've hauled Star Wars to Neptune, Plasteel to the Federation. <sighs> this family operates nine different mining colonies across the Ariadne Arm. Mayda thinks she's better suited to lead. Her contract still says otherwise. I just cannot damn well tell whether it's the stupidest idea I ever heard. Or my only hope. I turned 80 years old last week. I thought I had another 80 in me, but marooned on this planet, there's no swapping out of my liver when the old one fails. Here, I'm mortal. And Maida is useful. So, it's my responsibility to make a decision. Return to the island and hope whatever knocked the Degazi out of the sky won't do the same to the rescue ship. Or take us deeper in search of answers. And all the while be hoping old age gets me before the sea monsters do. I'll give Maida just one thing. She was right about these caves. There's enough lithium there to fabricate a hundred tons of plasteel. Enough for a damn fleet of Cyclops submarines. There was nothing anyone could have done to avoid crashing here. But I was right to order the detour. If we get off this planet, they'll be talking about the Torgel's share price on the other side of the Federation. <laughs> wow. He turned 80, but then he hoped he had another 80 years left. So apparently these humans can live longer. Hi, why are you hitting me? Is that a bitey fish? I bet it's a bitey fish. Oh, well, it's it's something. Stop swimming into me, you weird-looking peepers. Okay, so we've got the signal. Now let's go check out the beacon. We don't need this one anymore. Where's the new one at? Uh, where are you at, beacon? Where's the new beacon? Proposed 500 meters. Okay, so that... Again, what I've heard is in the Deep Grand Reef, and I don't know if there are any baddies down there. Oh, wait, we should probably go back up this way. But if there are, we've got the defense mechanism on Petunia, and we should be fine, hopefully. I mean, I've got my stasis rifle. I didn't check the battery power in it, but I'm sure it's good. But that's incredible. So they went deeper into the ocean, which maybe wasn't a good idea. I would have stayed on the islands. At least nothing there, you know, could hurt them. Drink up this water. Eat that. Probably eat that, too. I think one water would be good. All right, which way do I go, boss? Which way do I go? Oh, my God, this thing is so far away. Here we go, y'all. Let's see what happens this go around. Oi. Okay, so I was over here before, and I remember seeing these glowy ball things. I'm gonna give it one more shock. Okay, yeah, because I remember seeing that wreck as well. Oh, yeah. Okay. I am familiar with this area a little bit. What's all this? Just wreckage. Probably heard Jazz, my dog, boofing in the background. Okay, what is down here? Warpers. I know warpers are over here. Okay, so I know that warpers are around here. But, what else is around here? Okay, so I see jelly rays. I'm assuming I have to go this way. There's nowhere else to go, and I gotta follow that beacon. No warpers. Ooh, gel sacks. I'm just putting that off just in case. I have no idea what's around here. I haven't seen a warper yet, but I know that they're around here. Ooh, is that a uraninite crystal? Or is that a creature egg? That's a creature egg. What up, Jelly Ray? 
Okay, there's the warper right there. Or a warper. I don't know how many hang around here. Big old glowy balls. Oh, hell. Is that a crab squid? Oh, hell. A titanium mass somewhere in this area. Frickin' balls. Of course it's a crab squid. I'm gonna just shock it. Okay. And then I need to make sure that I have my stasis rifle. Stasis rifle. Stasis rifle. Where the hell is my... There it is. Okay. No. Where are you? you damn crab squid! Oh. Fuck! I'm gonna shoot you with my... With my thing. Yes. And then I'm just gonna cut the shit out of you. Gotcha! 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 Die! Just die! Did it die? I hope I killed it. Repair. Petunia. There better not be another crab squid around here. I'm gonna be so pissed. Oh. And that thing only has 7% power. Do I have any batteries? Oh, frick. I don't have any batteries. Welcome aboard, Captain. I hope there's some other crab squids around here. I killed that one. So what is this? Okay, I see stuff around here. Oh, I hear the warper. I hear the it's damn warper. Data. Oh man, I gotta be quick. I've got to be quick in what I do. So how the hell? I can't get in there. How do I get in this thing? Oh, here. Through here. Perhaps? Maybe? I can't get in this way? What the hell, man? What the frick is going on? There we go. Do I have my flashlight? I do, but it's at 6%, which is just frickin' great. All right, what is in here? I don't want to grab a bag. Oh, another PDA. Okay. Okay. Integrating new PDA data. Where's my scanner? Oh my gosh, y'all, this is a, like I'm so enamored right now. Is there anything I can scan in here? What's in this carry-all? Is there anything in this carry-all? No, I'm going to drop it. So, how do I get up the stairs? I know there's an upstairs. Is there a ladder that I missed? No, there's not. Whoa, I can see upstairs. Whoa, okay, I need to see here. How in the hell do I get out? I need to go back to, whoa, hi. I need to go back to Petunia. Oh, wait. Uh, real quick, for some oxygen. There's another crab squid. Shit, shit, shit. I can't be seen. Oh my god, I can hear it. Oh my god, I can hear it. Okay. What was I supposed to scan? I was supposed to scan something. What was I supposed to scan? Whoa, what is this? Alien containment? Like a fish tank? Sweet. What's over here? More stuff. Uh, yes, I will take that. Integrating new PDA data. You know I'll take that. Oh, there is a ladder, but apparently I didn't use it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, what's over here? Cyclops shield generator. Dang! Oh, my battery died. Okay, my battery died. Um, now I need to get out of here. Get back to Petunia. 
Make sure nobody saw me. Alright. Oh, wait a second. Did I miss a thing? <gasps> I did miss a thing. Oh my god, there was another thing. Okay. So then... Damn, I don't have any freaking flashlight power to see. Oh my. Is there any way to get in this fish tank? Any way at all? I guess not. All right, so there was a ladder. What do I do with the ladder? Got that. Here is the ladder. How do I get down here? How do I get down there? Do I, oh, I just swim. Oh. Well, okay. Ooh. Pick that up. <gasps> Ooh, an orange tablet. I found an orange tablet. Oh, yeah. I got a creature egg. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, so then... Let me go up here. And find my way out somewhere. Out of here. Oh, shoot. The battery just died. All right, well, hey. Listen, it was nice knowing you. But... Uh, we're going home. That was cool. Oh my god. We found all the stuff. And I killed another crab squid. I am not mad about that. I think this is the way out. Oh, maybe it isn't. No, it had to be the way out though, right? It had to be the way out, I think. Oh, shoot. Stay away from that damn freaking guy. Warper. Leave me alone, Warper. Okay, so there were ju- What the hell? Where am I? Wait, just a minute. Oh, shit. Ah, uh, what? What? What am I doing? Who am I pissing off? I need to drink water real quick. Oh, my God. I have a creature egg. And I have a fish tank. I can have whatever creature egg that is in there. What are these? Is it just one or is it two? Oh my god, it's just one. What the hell? What are you, dude? Are you, like, friend or foe? Oh, shitesa. Sorry. Oh, you sound so pissed. What is this? Oh, I gotta get out. I gotta get out. I gotta get my scanner. I gotta scan it. Sea Treader. Oh, my God. It's freaking huge, everybody. Oh, what a big boy. Girl. Creature. Whoa, where did it go? Am I looking the wrong oh with this way? Did it go did you go this way? Did you fall? Sea treader. Oh, there's so many of them. They stomp on the Whoa, hi! I really am not. Try to piss you off. Whoa! Buddy. Are y'all like the elephants of Subnautica? Okay, look, we gotta go home. I mean that's cool as heck. We gotta go home. So we we did it. We got the Degasi habitat, like the super, super deep one. Killed a crab squid. Pretty happy with myself. Managed to uh, evade warpers and sea treaders. Sea treaders. I would not want to get under their feet. They seem to stomp the ground. And I think I pissed that one off. I, I don't really know. But that's really cool, isn't it? Oh, that makes me so happy. And we got our new radio signal. I wonder if that was triggered by something that we did just now. We're going to need more food and water. Uh, sorry, peeper. Right. 
right, shut the light off. Let's get out. Let's get some food and water real quick. You know, I was thinking about putting ooh, another bladderfish, a water tank thing in my habitat. Because I'm kind of tired of always, always having to chase down bladderfish for water. So what if I put like one of those water filtration systems in my habitat? I think that would be kind of efficient. Welcome aboard, Captain. Yes, hello, how are you? Let's check out this radio signal. This is life pod two coordinates attached. We're way past our safe depth and bleeding O2. What? We'll have to swim for the surface, but it's 500 meters straight up. We'll make for the rendezvous and keep you posted. Out. Signal location uploaded to PDA. We have another life pod to check out? I thought we got all the life pods. Well, all the life pods there were. That's weird. That's so strange. I guess we're gonna go find life pod two. I mean, we got life pod 12 and I thought that that was gonna be the most difficult one to grab, but I guess not. We have the blueprints for, where is that? We probably need the uh, habitat builder to make that fish tank thing, huh? Okay, so I put in another multi-purpose room on top of the other one. I'm gonna have to use some kind of reinforcements, put in a ladder, and now I need to get glass so that I can build this. But as I was doing that, another radio signal popped up. Play partially translated broadcast. Destroyed. What? Mode. Patrol. New targets unaccounted for. One. Is that me? Am I the target? I need to look for some quartz here. That's kind of scary, actually. Do I have any glass in here? Oh, I do have quartz. Okay, what about in here? No, just diamonds. All right, gotta find at least five glass. Oh, look, a bunch of quartz around here. All right, let's get looking. We're gonna find all the quartz, maybe. Where is it? Oh God, why? God dang it, go away. Stupid little exploding fish. All right, so let's get water and then I wanna finish making this aquarium. I really do. Cause I wanna put this egg in there. So let's make the rest of this glass. Crap, how many glass do I have? I have four, I just need one more. Vital signs stabilizing. Well, I'm glad. All right, come on, quartz. Oh, I'm gonna need more bladder fish. Back to the base. We will create the aquarium, put that mysterious creature egg in it, and then we will go find whatever life pod I guess we're missing. Which is still interesting to me. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you. I want to shut these off first. Here we go. There. So now we have full food and water. Five glass for this aquarium. Uh, we made a ladder. That's right. All right. So we're up here. Let's grab the habitat builder. Get this. Whoa. Hello. Get the aquarium built. Or, excuse me, alien containment built. Which is cool as heck. An ideal opportunity to study alien fauna up close. Yeah, how do we? Which life forms you bring on board? Okay. They may also be studying you. Oh. Well. Do I have to put like a hatch on it to get in it? Oh yes, not the bioreactor. I want the water thing. Copper wire arrow gel. Okay, so that was just a sidetrack thing. But do I need to put a hatch? Oh, apparently I do. Alrighty. So then I'm also going to need to reinforce this. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, use planter. I guess I'll put... What did I do with that little egg? 
Did I store it? Oh my god, I hope I didn't drop it somewhere. Did I store the egg? Please tell me I stored it. Oh, I did. There it is. Sweet. Ooh, I might put some bladder fish in there too. Oh yeah. So I have like bladder fish and peepers at my disposal. Okay. So, no, I don't want to, what, what? Why are we doing that? There's a planter? Oh, I can put plants in there. Oh, I don't want to do that. No. But I do. Can I, how do I put a creature egg in there? Oh, I just drop it in there. Okay. Well, I mean, that's good to know, you know, like. Look at that. It's, it's like doing stuff. Oh my God. Hang on a minute. It's moving. Oh my God, it's blinking. Don't tell me that this thing is cute. Can I crouch? I want to crouch. Can it look at, oh my God, you are adorable. I got to get in there and look at this thing. I've got to get in there and look at this. Can I, can I scan it? Is that thing scannable? I want to look at you. How do I get face to face with you? Oh my God, you are freaking adorable. Hello. Hello. Oh, I gotta get out of here before I spend the whole episode just fawning over you. Whatever you are, please don't be something that wants to kill me though, please. Okay, I wanna reinforce this base. How do I reinforce? Oh, I need lithium and titanium. Okay. I mean, I can totes do that. I have... Should have a crap ton of lithium. Lithium. That's lit. Lit. No, I don't want to rename it. Lithium. What? Where's all my lithium? I've spent this whole game, like, having... There we go. There's lithium. Okay. Now I just need titanium. Well, that was easy enough. Good grief. Can I grab you? Like, are you grabbable? You are not grabbable. Why am I hearing jelly rays? Why are they, like, right here? I don't understand. Alright, should have titanium in the Cyclops. Welcome aboard, Captain. All yes. systems online. Hi. How are you, holy crap balls? Oh, look at all that titanium. Perfect. Anything in here? No. Nope. All right. Let's go reinforce this thing. Then we're going to go find that other uh, life pad. We're going to do the thing, y'all. All right. Um, let me go in here. Oh, I need to reinforce it from the outside. That's right. My bad. Reinforcement. Sweet. What am I looking for? Oh, I have. Oh, I have stuff. Oh, I do. I could put those fish inside of. Oh, yeah. Let me put them inside here just to do that. Oh, there's a little baby. All right, we're gonna drop, drop. Now look, I have bladder fish and a boomerang fish swimming around. So cool. Oh, look at my pets. Yeah. Love you guys. All right, we go this way now. Now we can finally go find that other life pod. Heck to the yeah. Wait a minute. Where's Petunia? Petunia. Or should we take? No, I don't want to take baby crap balls. Uh, Petunia, where are you at? There you are. Welcome aboard, Captain. Yes, thank you. Oh. CTO used life pod sunk 500 meters before she abandoned it. Whoa, hi. Let's be careful with Petunia, please. I could have swore I already got this one. Oh, okay, that's where the 
cave entrance is for the Lost River. Now, that brings me to another point here. I need to find other access points to the Lost River because I know that there is something important going on down there. Not only do I need the mineral deposits that are down there, the kyanite, I believe it's called, which I did find out was down there. Thank you to the people who helped me out with that. Um, but also, I'm pretty sure that whatever that thing was that was growling when we were researching, I'm pretty sure that's over in that area too, like down underneath the Lost River, and we can't get down that far in just Petunia. We have to take Holy Crap Balls, so I do need to find another opening that is big enough for Holy Crap Balls. Listen, you bone sharks better go the hell on. Go away. Why does it have to be down here? Why the hell does it have to be down here? Ooh, I don't think I have found this one yet. There better not be any freaking crab squids. I'm gonna be so damn pissed. Oh, God. No, warpers. God dang it, warpers. Can you just... Frickin' balls! They're everywhere! Oh my God, it's a f***ing crab squid! Holy shit! Holy shit. God damn it! Dude, where's this fucking crab squid? Oh my god, that was scary. Integrating new PDA data. Listen, y'all better leave me the hell alone. Just frickin' leave me alone. Oh my god, did it break my, my... Oh my god, it broke Petunia! No, it didn't. She's right there. Holy shit, that scared me. Did it transport my Seamoth? Oh my god. It fucked with my Seamoth. I gotta repair it. I gotta repair it. Okay. Holy crap. Get me out of here! That mess with me so bad I lost sight of my sea moth! What the hell? Where did that crab go? Oh my god. Okay, I got it. Whatever. Whatever. Where is home? Where the hell is home? Over here. Home is this way. This is home. Let's go home. Holy crap balls. That was intense. Like freaking hell. Two warpers and a crab squid. There was no chance in hell of me not getting warped out of my sea moth. Damn. Why does everything in Subnautica that is so freaking amazing also want to just fucking kill me? Why? I want to heal you all. I can see your green spots. That's all I want. Oh my god. Is for us to get along with each other. <laughs> Bone sharks. Leave me alone. I mean, I get why the warpers are there. They're there to get rid of any species that aren't native to this planet. I understand why the warpers are coming after me. But it's the other ones I'm like, I just want to help you. Imagine having Disney princess powers in this game. Nothing would ever harm you because it would know that you're just there to help it. Now that we've gotten whatever the heck was on that life pod. Okay, let's see what, what is up with the baby in this tank. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you. Let's go see what's up with this baby in the egg thing. Oh, I forget how fast it transports. It's just hanging out. And the boomerang fish and uh, bladder fish are just hanging out. Sweet. Oh my god, it's like trying to swim. That's so cute. I don't know what it is, but God, I hope it doesn't want to kill me. All right. Is there anything in my inventory that I could make? Anything? No, nothing I need to make. Uh. Oh, there was data. That's right. Okay. Let's see. What is this? Flotation devices failed. We're flooding. 
Evacuate. Wait. I can reconfigure the O2 system to act as a bilge pump. It's working. Okay, good news. We're alive and we've stopped sinking. Bad? The oxygen's going to run out in 30 minutes and we're 500 meters down. What do we do? We'll have to use the remaining juice to send a distress call and build whatever gear we can. Then we find a way to the surface. Oh boy, I don't think they ever found a way to the surface. All these crew members. How many pods are there? Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, we have Degasi voice logs. We should probably give those a listen as well. So let's go ahead and do that. Margaret, Maida has boarded the habitat. What are you so happy about, Maida? Say, kid, I brought you something. Is that a leviathan outside? Towed it home on the back of the sub. You killed that thing? It's still breathing. I was about to finish the job, but I can stay in chat if you'd like. No? Then make yourself useful and pass me that hardened blade. Are you out of your mind? You brought that thing here? What if it's not as dead as it looks? What if others come? You prefer it got curious and came of its own accord, or got messed up and dragged here? When we get off this planet, I am going to drag you through every court in the damn Federation. Wow. She brought a leviathan. Was it a reaper? Or maybe it was a crab squid. I don't know because the crab squids were down there. I don't know. Well, there's another one. Let's give this a listen. I have had it with you risking our lives. Oh, stow it, chief. The kid can't kill this disease without fish to study. I'm just bringing him home. What? Tell her. Tell her I'm right. You're both wrong. Marguerite, I can't find out how they resist the bacteria if you slaughter them all. It ain't always they oblige in coming in alive. He means you're being reckless. Father, the outcome's no better if we hole up in here and don't go outside. But we have to find a middle way. There is no compromise. Not while she's on my sea base. Your sea base? I'm going outside. Bart, Torgal has disembarked the habitat. Bart, come in. It's dangerous. Damn it, boy. I know you can hear me. That is a reaper. Chief. Chief, get off the radio and put on your helmet. What? Brace! Oh, and then we have one more. We have one more. Let's see. Came out of nowhere. An alien kraken, bigger than a cyclops. Tore a hole clear through the reinforced hull. I barely got my breather in time. I told her. I said others would come. The rupture threw me clear of the habitat. And the monster turned and bore down on me. And just as its tentacles came within reach, neither appeared out of nowhere. She had a sea glide in one hand. A jagged piece of scrap metal in the other. She meant to butcher that beast or die trying. The last I saw her, she had the metal lodged in its neck as the monster did its best to shake her, contorting off into the darkness. I'm certain she got her wish, one way or another. Then I thought I saw a light deep below me. I hoped maybe Bart had swum clear. I followed it. Now, I wonder whether I saw anything at all. Oh, no. Our oxygen is low. The habitat is gone. I can't see the sky. Something surely has the scent of my blood. Oh, that's not good. So they all died down there, which is why it's tore up the way it is. It, maybe, it, maybe it wasn't a reaper. Maybe it was a crab squid. I don't know just don't know we've got a new little pet i guess growing in the aquarium upstairs which we've added uh to our habitat um we went and got more data downloads 
that we found in the Degasi habitat, which led us to the new one, which we discovered we lost our shit when we got uh, into an entanglement with warpers and a crab squid. And now we know the fate of the Degasi crew. I mean, we knew the fate anyway, but that's a horrible way to go. That's a horrible way to go. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. My name is Gal Sal. I am enjoying this game more and more and more and more and more, and I can't say it enough. Thank you so much for sticking around, for watching all the gaming videos, the vlogs, all the new stuff we have coming to the channel. If you are interested, uh, please join the Discord so you know what's going on. If you haven't, hit the subscribe button. Let me know that you're here. Leave a comment, like, share if you want. And I will see you all around. Until next time, bye!